I even press start streaming? Oh, I did. Do, 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 do. <clears throat> Hello, everybody. We are back again playing some Angels of Death. Uh, hope you enjoy. I actually have everything set up this time and you can actually see it all right, hopefully. I, I, I hope, anyway. Um. Yeah, so basically this game is, I'd say it's more of, it's a horror one, but it's also kind of in the uh, RPG kind of section, but um, they're making an anime out of it in the next season, and it looks really good and I really want to watch it. So I said, hey, let's play the game while we're waiting. So uh, yeah, we got so far, we watched like the third floor, and basically, yeah, hello everyone. Uh, basically, uh, what happened was... That uh, this girl, Rachel, you see her there with the blonde hair and the blue eyes, she wakes up in this weird apartment building and she's, she just can not only remember, she was like counselling because she saw someone dead. And um, then she finds out she's a sacrifice and that every single floor there's a serial killer. And Zach is one of them and he tries to kill her. She escapes him. Then she finds Dr. Danny, who's apparently a counsellor, and he wants her eyes. And then Zach comes in, kills Dr. Danny he refuses to kill her because she has a dead look in her eyes and then she asks him to kill him and he says no and then she helps him out and he's like all right i will if you help me get out of this entire place and yeah that's what that's basically um so far what has happened can you hear me okay is it all good i'm hoping it's all good is the can, can you hear the music and my voice is it like a, a good a good um uh, okay, so, um, can you hear me alright, by the way, um, it's not that, um, the guy here in the black hood, he doesn't want her eyes, um, Dr. Danny, he was her counsellor, he was in the last one, he wanted her eyes because he had, like, a wonky, it, it, there was something wrong with his eye, I think he couldn't really see through it, he had to use glass ones, and he really liked blue eyes, so he wanted hers, but he wouldn't take them until she, uh, had, um, until her eyes kind of had life back in them, but her eyes just looked dead, so that's as far as we got. Um, can you hear everything all right, by the way? Can, like, someone please help me out here? Like, can you hear the music and can you hear my voice? Is it, is it like, you know, is, 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 it, is that okay, you know? Like, can you hear the music and my voice or just one or? <laughs> you need to make sure everything's good before we start. Hmm, somebody please. You're all watching the stream. There's seven people here. One of you can tell me if the audio. You can only hear my voice. Okay, let's turn up that music, shall we? Uh, let's see here. Can you hear it now? Can someone tell me if they hear it now? Is, is it possible to hear now? Is, is it too loud or is it... Is it too loud or is it okay? Is it... is it... is it... is, is it too loud though? Is one of them too... is like the music too loud or is it just alright? It's okay, okay, that's grand. Okay, we are already sitting here right now. Woo! Sorry if it seems really zoomed up, I have to have it for this game. Okay, let's get into it then, shall we? What's that? Something's in the water. Oh, what voice did I give you? Ah, what is it? What the hell is that thing? No clue. Don't know. How the hell am I supposed to know? I see. 
stare at something all day is gonna help you isn't gonna help you understand it better. I'll move on. Okay. Yeah, I need to figure out the voices at some stage. It's not it's not like her voice is kinda of definite, but his changes Ooh. Hmm. This 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 doesn't fill me with confidence. Grave. Oh, I wonder it smells like blood. Wanna try digging it up? Whatever. You're no fun. Um Okay, it's not too yeah, the screen's fine. There's a dirt covered pickaxe. It's just a grave. Do you wanna get in it that bad? But this one won't do. It's already occupied. Something shiny could be seen in the grave. Reach for it. Huh? What the heck are you doing? What are you fumbling around there for? Something down there? I can't reach it. Oh, just do this. Ah, but the body! Its leg fell off. Acquired a key, woo! There's a lot of dug up dirt. You can hear, like, the music and all the sounds, right? It appears to be a gravestone with a name engraved on it. Is there any specific name, or...? Nope, just, just all the same. It appears to be so minor, there's nothing inscribed on the back. What about the front? There is something pure. The pit will unwanted by the master and his angels, await to be purified, plummeting to the depths, and be buried in the ground. Well, that's not morbid. It says Graveyard 1. The door is locked. Can we use the key? Oh. What are you waving that key around for? Obviously not that door, then. It says Graveyard 2. And this must be Graveyard 3! No, no, this is the morgue. Okay, you only need two. You, you only. Okay, thanks everybody for being responsible there. You only need. Guys, did you know you only need two graves, you know? I should have read it. It says morgue key. <laughs> Alright, Man, it's freezing in here. There is damp and reeks of chemicals. I don't want to stick around here for long. Gotta find a way to... I can't read. Gotta find a way to get the hell out of here fast. Here's where Spore changes the extreme. Cleanse thyself. The master expects a pure soul and body. It's an empty coffin. It's an empty coffin. Please be trying to fear, but it's locked. Yeah, morgues are fun. I like to chill braids air. Please be trying to freeze. The trap door has been left open. There's small okay. Piece of scrap paper inside. Watkin Beckett 36 POD B3 COD blood loss from bullet wound. Mr. Beckett had the B4 key on his person, but it has yet to be found. It appears he lost it. Due to severe injuries, he used caution when handling. An arm was lost while being cleaned in a tank. This guy died. Yep, it says B3, so it says so he died there. Around B4, which means there's still more floors above. Are you familiar with this place? Well, I guess I could say well, his voice sounds too feminine. Oh, thanks for liking. What voice are you? Well, I guess you could say that. I'm just here because someone told me I could kill whoever I want. The same goes for the guys in the forest too, huh? Even I'm not up on the details. I see. Oh man, I messed with the grazer earlier, making my hands reek and they're all gunky. Yep. Sounds too feminine for a minute, I need to change it. Do we need to send, cleanse thyself before we enter? The wall is crumbling. The place is damp and turned to shambles when it's done. It's cracking all gear into the hole, or if it's space on their side, but it's too dark to see anything. You can rinse your hands off here. Oh. <laughs> I, I you're welcome, my heart nice comments. I tried to be interactive with the community at least. Um Okay, wait a second guys. That's a tad better. Ah 
see the shinies in the water. Acquired a key. Graveyard one key. <laughs> nice. We can't open this now, can we? Nope. We're here for graveyard key. Another grave. One after another. Why in hell would you need so many graves in a place like this? The Holy Hand of the Covet. Those master, those master Covet, 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 those pure angelic adorers, and those exceptional shall lay thyself to rest for this magnificent privilege. So, but heed my words, wicked souls that betray the master shall be damned here in all eternal hell. So this person seems quite religious. Uh, thanks, Shane. Also think that, you know, the, the, the kind of thing they might be like doing good to the world. Here's my grave song with the name engraved on it. Okay, just the same thing. Just a hole deep hole in the ground. On the holy stone. There's a new gravestone. A name is meticulously engraved on it. Huh? What's wrong? Something's written on it. A name's written on it. Duh, all gravestones have on them. Have names on them. What are you freaking out over? It says Rachel Gardner. That's my name. My name's written on it. No way. So mine's written on this one? Shit. What is this? This fucked up horrible place. Hey. Hey, don't stare at the gravestone. No offense, but I have no intention of dying with you. Okay, we're getting the hell out of this place one way or another. And that's not weird at all. There's a fairly large crack in the wall. There's a weird hole here. I'm not gonna fit in there. Guess we're out of options. How about I go? Huh? You're just saying that so you can get it, so you can bolt. I won't run, not until I'm killed. Damn, you've been giving me the creeps for a while. But enough about that. Anyway, you can't just sit here and do nothing. Go take care of it. Oh, if you die, then give me a I'm dead, so to let me know. I can't if I'm dead. Shut up. In that case, at least be useful before you die. I don't know if I was going to go down here yet, though. Or if I was meant to go... Okay, that's fine. Yeah, I don't have to go down here. Just have to check before I enter into the crack in the wall. Can you hurry up in hell and get impatient? Okay, fine. Then come Joe's and piss me off and I'll kill you without even batting an eyelash. Come on, get a move on. Dorian, he needs to have more of a psychotic voice, but I can't really give him one. I can do it in a female voice, but I'm not going to do a female voice around because he's not female. Go in. Hmm. This place is a mess. There's a torch inside the box. Quite a torch. This might be still of use. I first learned of that kid, I've always been curious, but I didn't know her for the longest time. I long to see her, but the bastard's always in the way. She has such a beautiful voice. She must be so, so lovely. She must be. I mean, that's why I fell for her overnight. Oh dear, I gotta make something special for her. I gotta think of something special only for her. Place of eternal rest. That's not weird at all. Sign for a great song written on a sheet. It appears to be an inventory of gravestones. You know, this this person seems a bit weird. Unpolished stone. Soil clothing and gloves inside. Swearing up. What's in the box? Please bring your shells and tools are inside. New gravestone. New gravestone. 
do. Grace was This piece of child's handwriting. Fairly smart schematic esque documents, but I have no idea what they're for. Okay, there's another name. Okay. That's, is that all, or do I just continue over here then? The door's tightly shut. There's no keyhole. There's a lot of them all jumbled together, but nothing really looked like a clue. This is a dead end too. Hmm, what to do? Guess I'll go back for now. What's up? This guy's gonna get on my nerves. I wanna smash it to bits. Your weapon will probably give away first. Shut up. Don't you think I know that? Never mind that. Did you find anything on the other side? The passage leads to a room that winds around to the right. There was a door there, but it was locked, so I kind of couldn't go any further. The door has no keyhole, so I think there must be some kind of mechanism mechanism that opens it. You don't say, well, keep looking. Okay, you could look in there, but could you look here too? What? Door, mechani <laughs> door mechanisms and I don't get along. Yeah. Fine, I'll go. Okay. Mm, huh? Got something else to report? Do me a favour and don't destroy my grave. Who gives a flying fuck? Oh, I wait, open the door. I didn't think there was some sort of strange schematic earlier. Hmm, I wonder. Different to the others. I suspect this is a clue for the mechanism. Hmm, this sequence of squares. That pong. Flocking mechanism. Where the hell am I supposed to look for that? The only thing around here is graves. But I guess I can't just sit here all day. Fine, I'm game. I'll just have a look around and take in the morbid sights. Mad, but man, this grave is freaking annoying. Nothing would make me happier than smash it. But as the little shit said, that'll ruin my blade. Maybe while I'm on it, I'll pick up something that could smash it. Yeah. Fun times. Hmm. Where can you go? Oh, this. Dirt covered pickaxe. Oh, this'll do nicely. Quiet old pickaxe. Let's try pulverizing that gravestone with this. Um, we can't go in here, can we? Maybe you'll find something in here then. Hmm. Okay. Just go smash the rock then. A grand old time smashing the rock. God damn, it just won't break. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. This time rock giving me trouble. For a shitty great stone you should put up a tough fight. Oh, it just occurred to me. The other great stones are now are now fair game too. <laughs> wow, they break the way these tinker toys. I keep smashing them until I feel better. Oh yeah. We don't destroy her one though, because she asks us not to.
Oh, I can make this crew take that. Have I smash off crates and just fall automatic? You think crates are just a bunch of stupid ass corpses? It's a very evil one, it doesn't matter. Crates are broken. Almost there. I don't want to like smack her when she asks or something. Nice. Is this all of them? Huh? What was I doing again? Oh yeah, the mechanism. I was too busy smashing and I wasn't keeping an eye out. Was there something? Maybe it wouldn't hurt to take a look. Well, I mean, we're looking. And then we just smash the all of the rocks. You know? Uh, didn't she say not to break this one? Shit. What the hell is she going to do a grave like this for? No, we haven't fit in there. <sighs> what am I going to use? Here, maybe? Um, you feel bad for those corpses? <laughs> no, at least he wasn't hurting the corpses, he was just hurting the. Uh, is there anything in here? That's nice, so I can't figure that's what's wrong. There's nothing in here. Locked. Um, I don't know where the hell else I'm meant to go. I can think of, we've literally been everywhere. Uh, oh god, no idea what the hell I'm going to do. Makes no sense to me. I've been everywhere. Um, yeah. I've literally been everywhere. But where am I meant to go? Where the hell am I meant to go? There's nothing for me to pick up either, so I'm quite confused. I looked in the morgue too, so I have no idea what. Flashlight. 
So I need to switch back to... Because I can't find anything. Like, am I just being stupid or... I mean, surely you'd be able to, like, knock open the door with a pickaxe, right? Like, it's just my opinion. There's nowhere for me to go. And, like, nothing's triggering anything. And literally, there's nothing for me to do. Like, where, where am I meant to go? To, like, look in the gravestones or. Uh... Oh, oh, here. Some sort of switch is visible in the debris. Huh? Ah, <laughs> oh, we did it. Hmm, just sequence of squares. There's 16 of them and a calculation for them is written below. Is this referring to the breaks? It's not off because I've been hearing all this time. If this is the grace and my matching pronunciation with them. Maybe something, well, just maybe something will happen here. The heck is that sound? The door is back open. Did he open it? The door is unlocked. How did he get a mechanism for this? It's dark. Gotta turn on a light. Oh, this, this is bad. It's talking about someone's name and work history written on it. It appears to be a resume. It appears to be a resume. Oh, it's a resume. Felt to the pen open. You must file the resumes. Ah. What can Beckett this name I saw earlier? And uh, just I saw it looks like the guy died here. No file resume slipped out below the files. This one, about. This one has my name on it. Talks about me in great detail. Hmm. Ah, uh, there's another one. This name is really someone else's name. Isaac Foster, DOB unknown, estimated age 20s. Childhood? In childhood, there is evidence that he was placed in an orphanage. The institution was unauthorized, therefore, details surrounding it are unknown. Possible tra trafficking. The institution was later charged for substandard living conditions, but Isaac Foster was already missing by then. Concurrently, the bones of several children were found in the institution's yard. Moreover, also found is the, also found is what's believed to be the slaughtered bodies of the proprietors proprietors. There is a large gap between the period of death from the slaughter children proprietors. Based on the slashings and the bodies inside the institution, the subject is believed to be Isaac Foster. The whereabouts of Isaac Foster are, are currently unknown. However, he's involved in a series of psychotic murders taking place in State Redacted. Several years later, the murder scenes extend to several locations. No obvious dis dis disposition or rituals at the time of the crime, however, it has a tendency to strongly react to human emotion. This is great physical prowess, but is poor at planning, lacks education and intelligence. Further, his entire upper body is bandaged due, due to burns that are believed to be sustained during his stay at the facility in childhood. Edit was originally assigned to B6, but was resigned due to rule violation. Cause of death, blank. Cause of victim, victim was blank. Ah, so Isaac is, uh, Isaac is Zach. <laughs> I don't know why that was so hard for me to understand. This is probably him. He committed murder at the institution where he lived as a serial killer. Has he been murdering people here ever since? The cause of death and his victims are blank. If I die, then my name will go there. 
He's on the run now, though. I wonder how many he's killed. I'll take this back to him for the time being. Come to think, I haven't looked in the back of this room yet. Uh, yeah, you haven't. Can we look at the books? Children around on the shelf. Spinner Saucy. Religious. I feel like I'm not familiar with this subject matter. It doesn't really make sense. Okay. Numerous books. A cult. Oh. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. I can make out something in the back. Is it a door? I want her to check. Wait, this is hollow spot. If I stand here on top of it, a switch sounds, but nothing happens. The door is tightly shut. There's no keyhole. Some sort of me mechanism, like hollow spot, on this floor, but something when it doesn't work. Okay. That's cool. Do we go back now? Is that what we do? Do we go back now? Oh no. That laugh doesn't sound good. Is somebody there? Um. I know what you desire. I like you, so I'll make you lovely. After all, this is my domain. This floor is. Hey, what are you fucking around for? Hurry up. Better head back for a bit. this? What you, you- what? You took so long. What the hell are you, were you up to? I should ask you the same. And any news? Beyond the door on the back right side, there was some sort of archives room. There was another door in the back of that room too. It also had no keyhole and was shut. Huh? Another one? Oh, and I found this. Huh? A resume? A resume? What's written on it? Tell me... It's about Rachel Gardner. That's worthless bullshit. All it does is tell your story and if more enough than this. Also, there was also one for some guy named Isaac. Is that you? And what are your impressions from reading that? Yep, that's right. I'm Isaac Crafter. Your impressions. Nothing special. It's a sheet of paper about you. Nothing more, nothing less. Are you not afraid of me? Afraid? No, I'm not. A girl like you once said the same thing a long time ago. At first she was afraid, but once she got wise to me, she be- to me being- Once she got wise to me being the serial killer in the newspaper, she started acting different towards me. Then she wouldn't shut up the hell up. I'm not afraid of you. Or, I'm your biggest fan. It was so cute, so I gave her a five second head start instead of the usual three. Too bad she didn't get far. So when I tried to kill her, she went batshit crazy. I didn't know what the hell to make of it, so I told her to hold if she wasn't still if she wasn't afraid. Then, she screamed, but she only said that because she feared for her life. I guess the dumb bitch thought she could ask kiss her way into surviving, eh? I hate liars. So, I killed her. Is that story supposed to relate to my request to have you kill me? Uh -huh. If I took the same approach, could I get you to kill me? Oh yeah, you gave me three seconds, not five. Are you fucking crazy? Oh shit, that's right, this bitch wants me to kill her. So, her not being afraid means... What's wrong? Nothing. So wait, why aren't you afraid of me? 
don't even know you very well. Know me? You read the paper, didn't you? What, you're illiterate? I read it. But I just met you earlier, so I still don't know much about you. Therefore, I have no inter... 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 God, in, I, interpretation? I, I know I said that wrong. Oh no, people are here. Oh god, stuff happened in the chat. Ooh, you suck. Uh, I think she's great, and if you want to say bad things about her, girl, they sort of so boring, dude, so. <sighs> stop, stop being mean about yourself, mate. <laughs> I still don't know. Yeah, okay, I said that. I can say what I want. Yeah, plus you're a moderator. <laughs> Meh, have it your way then. Oh, and is that all? Um, there's a mechanism in the front of the door, but I believe there's probably another one, so I'm going to take a look around here. I see. Oh, and something else. They're still not done. I heard a voice. I think it's from the master of this floor. The voice said it knows my desire. You don't say, hey, let's move. Ah, but before we go... I just gotta smash this one too before it tries me up the fucking wall. Huh? This one's a stubborn one. <laughs> Sorry, I'm OCD like that. That's great. Something being the only one that's bugging the shit out of me. Hey, that's it out. There's no great for you here. Once we get out of the basement, I'll find you a nice one. I mean, personally, I think this is a beautiful relationship. I mean, like... I'm not really your fun. I just love this relationship. <laughs> hey, you know, if you get me out of here, I'll kill you. Yay! <laughs> but you're also kind of insane for a girl. Like, you know, like you. Cool, I don't care, I'm just gonna listen to you. Okay! <laughs> Here's a small note. Let me help you. Hey, you find something? It's nothing. Oh, is this another note? Here's a small note. If you want to suffer, I'll make it painful. If you want to go without pain, I'll be gentle. Whichever way you prefer. I mean, no here, right? Uh, nope, there's no note here. Maybe it wants me to continue going this way. Hey, how do you want to die? What do you keep stopping for? It says I'll gladly kill you. <laughs> Something's floating in the water. Is that what I think it is? Oh, that? What are we going to do about it? I'm not sure, but I want you to go in there and stand in the submerged tunnel area. In the water? You want me to do what? If you're gonna cry about it then. Hey, I didn't say I wasn't gonna do it. I'm like you, there's no way in hell I'd die in a place like this. You've been slammed as shit this whole time. Anyways, don't get any crazy ideas about dying or being killed. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be stuck here any longer than I gotta be. Are you really gonna kill me? I'm such... I'm such a nobody. If you want to die so bad, then why not just kill yourself? 
Because it's unfor unforgivable. Huh? Why is that? Because it's will of God. Hell if I know. Well, even if I'm not entirely sure. But if it's the word of God, then it must be absolute. It's unforgivable. Oh, God says so, huh? In that case, you gotta prove your worth to me before I can kill you. What do you want? Make yourself useful. Also, if I'm gonna kill you, can, can you try and make up with my wild show anger or cry for your life? Show anger or cry for my life? You know, facial muscles just... Sh facial muscles... Facial muscles... I can't say muscles. You know, facial... <laughs> Facial muscles. You know, facial muscles show emotion, right? Um, sure, you're not already dead. I'm alive, so I want you to kill me. Ah, fine. Hey, can you give me a smile? Smile? How's that? You're dead in the eyes. Yeah, that's no good. What are we wasting time on this crap for? Hey, so I just need to sat on top of that thing over there, right? Hell, hurry and get over already. It's cold and gross over here. Okay. I was gonna place early with the hollow sponge on top of it. Okay. I still am not sure on his voice. He's meant to be like a serial killer who's kind of psychotic. But I can't really like do that type of male voice. I can only really do female ones like that. I always think I actually always think someone's knocking on my door with that. <laughs> oh, there's another note, lovely. Small note. Don't be startled. You know why? Because we are the one and because we are one and the same in our desires. Yeah, like this, like this bitch, who's pretty psychotic. It's dark, that's a lot of light. Small note. I shouldn't find what you desire, but I've got my own desires as well. If possible, I want you to devote yourself to me. I mean, isn't it great being in love? Uh, not, not in that way. Not, not in that way at all. Oh, lovely, another note. I know all about you. You want to die, right? Right? So just say yes. Door is the door unlocked. Shit, how long do I got to stay in this water for? Hey, it feels like something's around on my feet. That means I can move now, right? wonder how she's doing. Guess I'll head back to the hole she went in. I like his size. You know, I I'd choose the size as a murder weapon too. Oh, what the? Looks like some dumbass forgot to pay the electric bill. Damn rat chap of the place. Okay. She's still not back. What the hell is inside there anyway? That bitch bolts on me. Nah, that will happen. That is up with her anyway. Went wrong and all emotionless. Yeah, killing her will be boring as fuck. Hmm. Apart from that dead eyed stare, she almost looked alive back there. Ugh. I'm about to go out of my mind. I think he kind of cares about her. Like, he's interested in her in her way. Not again. Oh no, it's good <sighs> Oh, are you freaking serious? It's pinch black. Are you going through the hole now? Who's there? 
You great desk critter. Huh? Howdy, Zach. I don't know, he's a guy, but I'm just gonna do a high pitched voice. I had a nice spot for you with everyone else, but you were in your own grave. Oh, you're insane. That may be, but you don't think mine was a piss poor excuse for a grave, no? Damn you. Sorry, due to the circumstances, yours was a bit of a rush job. The hole's only half dug. But your tombstone's just fine. It fits to a T. If you catch my drift, <laughs> how about I make you work for you first? Oops. Well, enough about you. I'm more interested in getting the girl's grave finished. I'm in love. It's always the same thing. Making graves with murder victims day in and day out. I was getting a touch bored. Sure, making graves with my passion, but the bodies that occupy them are not quite as lovable. Beauty is what they lack. For that girl, I have nothing more than to make the greatest of my dreams for her. I think we're around the same age too. Most of all, I want to show her I understand her. Well, we're made for each other. That should be infinitely more beautiful than some sloppy mangled corpse. Oh, should she desire it? Sloppy is perfectly fine too. You're trying to make me hurt. What? My sophistication makes me the perfect match for her. Too bad I can't say the same for you. That's why the one taking her life will be me. Sounds like some little pool doesn't know his face. <laughs> Shit, I can't see a hand over my face. Okay, he's meant to be a boy, right? Like, why is his laugh like. Hey, get your ass back here. It's cold. It won't open. But there should be a keyhole. I guess something's wrong with the torch. There it goes again. Is it running low on juice? Hey Rachel, I'll grant your desire. What was that? Only for my use. Temperature here displayed. So the fan is running. <sighs> the temperature is quite low. Now I feel a tad guilty for making Zach get in the water. What race is the water temperature? So is that spring. Okay. So, like, what do I want to do now? Do I to go back or? Uh, do you want me to do it? Where is this? Rachel no. Huh? What? Don't act so surprised. The one talking to you is the one to this whole time is not ever to me. There's nothing to run. I will fly off the handle and kill you like the others. Besides, I know what you desire. Love is a walk, just swung in his arms. My desire? Yes, that's right. 
No worries, I know everything about you. Your father and mother, those close to you, everything. If it were me, I'd take your life as painfully as possible and even make the perfect grave for you. Plus, just look at me, you and I are even around the same age. We're actually made for each other. I... What are you so silent for? Please, Rachel. Please say yes. You know, if I was uh, Rachel, I'd, I'd, I'd kind of be, you know, just a bit like, oh, no. Hey, get back out here. I said, get your ass back out here now. I'll tell him, shit. Did she not hear me? How freaking far did she go in? Ugh. Grave digging through shit takes. He's kinda, kinda out with me. That punk, he's in love with her and wants to kill her himself. This all makes me want to puke. I can't have a code tied on me yet. Hmm, she mentioned something about another room in the back and the right. Wasn't there a cold room wall inside of the room? I guess I'll take a look. Okay, yeah, first I want to save this because I've saved it in ages. Oh, I forgot I thought you run. Mix things a lot faster. It's cracking the wall. It's uh, not here. Oh, there it is. Hey, can you hear me? Are you there? Rachel, what's showing? Go on, tell me your desire. I want to die. Look, I told you so. Oh, Rachel. Let me to put you out of your misery. So, will you say yes? I'm getting impatient. Could, could it be his doing? Tell me why are you... Why are you with Zack? I promised to let him kill me. What? That's so messed up. I even offered to kill you myself, too. But if I let you, then he won't be able to get out of here. Is that all? That shouldn't be a problem at all. Hey, can you hear me? Are you there? Look, looks like lab mats here. Choose. Who will I your killer, him or me. My sweet Rachel, let me love him, put you to rest. Sophisticated, more like medicated. You're gonna kill her with a bored look on your face? What a fucking idiot. Oh, will you shut up, Rachel and I are talking? Hey, can you hear me? I'm not talking to the grave digging dipshit. I'm talking to you. Me? Yes, you. Listen up. Don't think for one second that you can die of your own love. There's plenty of people in this building who'd love to kill me. But I'll have the honour. I swear to God. To God? Uh huh. I can definitely see that scene in an anime, like just, even like the music, I can kind of definitely see it. Like, it's, even though it's a game and it's pixelated, you can really see like where it's definitely going to like follow easily for an anime. Like, I know there's a manga too, but I definitely think like it's, it's I, I like, you know, you can definitely see it become one. Just even the storyline and just the way it kind of goes, like it's quite easy to just kind of turn it into one. Make sure nobody else gets you first. I mean, this is kind of cute. Like, I know he's talking about like killing her and stuff, but it's still kind of cute. Like, like I mean, I can see where some people can ship them. <laughs> you know, hey, uh, can you kill me? Yeah, sure. Just you know, let me get you. Like, you know, let me get out of here first. Sure, mate. Sure. Okay. Rachel, hit the wall as hard as you can. Hey. 
shelf. <laughs> Where'd that fucking one go? Why, Rachel? Is it so wrong for me for wanting to kill you? Of course it's wrong, you fucking moron. My, you're so vicious, Rachel. Do you want him to kill you? He'll definitely bungle it up. Why not let me instead? I'll do a pristine job. Shut the fuck up, show yourself so I can tear you apart. Rachel, you are mine to kill. Can you wait for me till then? Damn, the bastard pulled it on me. So I just want to find this wind yourself. You'll be dead before I even have a chance to kill you. Yeah. Huh? Like I said before, if you're gonna die, then at least make yourself useful at first. If I do, then you'll kill me, right? That's what I've been saying. Like you said earlier. God, he said God. Yeah, to God. He said that you swear to God. Is what you said true? You'll swear to God. You swear to God you'll kill. God say yes. Then quit pressing me. I hate liars. I see. Gotcha. I'll do everything I can to make myself useful to you. Then we're good. So, what's the plan for now? I heard the sound of a door open earlier. I think it might be the door down below here. That kid is waiting, or so he said. Ooh. Okay, just, just probably gonna save it here. Say something? The power room. Funny enough, it still smells like dirt here. What the hell? More graves? Hey, don't get any ideas about going into any more holes. I said I wouldn't kill myself. <laughs> I suppose you did. Anyway, I got no intention of sticking around this dirt dump. Let's get the hell out of here. Ah, wait. Hey, what's your name again? Rachel Gardner. Oh, I'm taking you along for my own personal gain. But man, it's a pain having that nah, having you around, right, Ray? Hello, we meet again. Out of my way, fucking brat. What makes you think I gotta do what you say? Hey, Rachel, are you sure you don't want me to do it? Do you even know anything about who this guy is? He has no passion for grace and a sloth past. I read about his past in the document earlier. And that's the problem. Why choose him over me? I can kill you too, you know. He swore to God that he'd kill me. Oh, that's, that's her voice. That alone is everything to me. Who's this high and mighty God? That's crazy. This so called God of yours never told me any of this. No such freedom exists in this place. The only freedom we're given is for our actions on our own thoughts. And the right to kill. Hmm, you are not the one who will kill me. You hear that, honey, like that fucking brat. Oh, how dreadful. I was just wanting to bury you, preserving your beauty. Don't you know graves are terrible, cool, comfy? At the very least, let me take you there. No, you are the stallion. Shut up, it's not like you're anything different from me. Just another murderer. Speak for yourself. For all your physical strength, you still haven't been able to catch anyone with that empty head of yours. Unable to kill anyone, you're just a useless, angry mess. That's rich coming from you. You're the one who's desperate. Just a frustrated little dipshit who couldn't kill a fly if you were. Psh, give me a fucking break.
Shut your trap, you idiot. As far as I'm concerned, you don't exist. I'm after Rachel and her- <laughs> Rachel, I'll see you eternally in a lovely castle of stone. Ugh, damn it, not again. Where the hell are you? You're like a turret that will flush. I must kill Rachel. Ah, uh, watch out. This game has no... Rachel, go on ahead well me. You said something about power room, right? Should be somewhere around here. Go turn the power. Okay. Wait, Rachel. The batteries are almost dead. I gotta hurry. Oh shoot, where am I meant to be going? There's a deep hole in the ground. Where are you, Rachel? Oh come on, it's a maze? Ah, so that's where you are. I won't come on. Who found you, Rachel? I don't see how that works. Seems very hard. <sighs> Back again, again with the boss fights. She's moving. This isn't fair. She's not moving. Why aren't you turning this way? Oh, come on. But this is a glitch. Oh, there you go. Okay. Can do this. Come on, this is impossible. No idea where the hell it is. <laughs> yep. I know, you found me. Good little person. We can do this, we can do this. Shouldn't be that hard. Okay, yep, I know, I better hurry. It's kind of hard when I have no idea where the hell I'm going. I feel like this should... Can I not jump in the hole? No? Okay. Oh, down here. Oh no. I was just there. <sighs> okay, I think I know where to go now at least. I know, I'm not going back. I'm somewhere, don't worry. Oh, 
that's this is see I know where to go now but it's just the fact that I can't make it in time I probably should be sprinting more just sprints kind of harder to control plus we have to use like the keyboard I tried to plug in my Xbox controller for it but it doesn't work Oh, come on. Oh, wrong one. I'm somewhere, you don't swear about that. Please, please stop. Oh, not this again. I'm not anywhere, don't worry. Oh, is that it? Did I do it? <laughs> why, Rachel? Why? I even made a grave for you and everything. Can't you take a hint? Oh, wait, sorry. This, this is Zach. Can't you take a hint? She's dumb to your ass. Damn. Oh, he doesn't want your petty grave. Get away, traitor. Grave does grave fiend. Rachel, loose this fiend just roughing you and hopping to my grave. What do you say? Hey, if you're so obsessed with grave, then how about I bury you first? <laughs> I like Zack. I got the perfect one picked out for you. Oh, I almost forgot. I'll steal it up tight, just like I said. And that's that. Okay. Elevator door shut. Oh, can we not like open the elevator door from here? I guess not. Hey, not bad for a pumpkin. Lip shit sits fit under, just like he wanted. This marass grave taken bastard. Something's on the back of his grave. Switch this elevator gate. Whoa! It's probably the elevator switch. Oh, push it. Okay. Now we should be able to go up. Nice. Oh wait, going the wrong way again. Yippee. At last I can say goodbye to this dirt reading dog. This is B4, so I'll probably still, there's probably still more flowers above. Uh, when will it end? Sometime soon, hopefully, but there's like four chapters, so I take it, it doesn't take like, you know, soon. Um. Did I make myself useful to you, sir? Huh. You quit calling me, sir. Makes me edgy. How about Isaac? Zach. Call me Zach. Okay. Was I funny use to you, Zach? Just a tiny bit. Oh. Let's get going. Okay. I think it's kind of warming up to her a bit. What floor are we on now? Oh, is that the first chapter? I believe it to be. It was a good chapter, isn't it? I think. I like the music in this game. I love the credits roll. Ooh, there is Dr. Danny. Say the names, but 
Uh, I don't speak Japanese. So, uh. I like Zack's character, he's cool. That should do for today, we'll, can, we'll do the second chapter soon. Soon enough, anyway. Probably next stream. Either that or I'll, um, I'll either stream or do a video of uh, the new FNAF uh, custom night. I need to get back into gaming. Uh, there's also going to be FNMDs up soon. And just MDs in general. But uh, I'll probably have one up tonight, to be honest. Um, and then on Thursday, the roleplay is going out because that comes out on Mondays and Thursdays. Um, well, if I get it, <laughs> I'll have it edited by then, don't worry. We are 9 o'clock GMT my time. Um, and uh, yeah, that, that should be about it. I uh, stream this soon enough, either that or I'll be showing an app custom night, like I said. But yeah, um, thanks for joining me. Uh, I'll see you in the next one. Uh, yeah, okay, so thank you, goodbye. Uh, this might just take a second, I have to <laughs> uh, exit onto OBS. Uh, this looks weird for a second, fine. But uh, thanks for joining, um, I'll see you in the next stream or the next video. Depends on which one is up. So yeah, yeah see you tomorrow, today, later today, probably later today in a video, guys. So bye.